In the wake of the horsemeat scandal, the European Commission unveiled plans on Monday to impose bigger fines on food producers who commit fraud. The proposal comes after horse DNA was found in up to 5% of EU products labelled as beef after the Commission carried out food tests across the continent. When and if this package is approved, any pecuniary penalties relating to violation of EU legislation on these subjects must be equal to the economic gain which has been made out of the violation of the EU law. Crime must not pay. If the penalties, the pecuniary penalties are low, it does pay. We know that the horse meat scandal was not a question of food safety, but it was a question of deliberate fraudulent labeling to make economic gain because in most countries horse meat is cheaper than beef. Amid concerns that the horse meat scandal has hit consumer confidence and has reduced trading opportunities, the new legislation allows Brussels to carry out unannounced food controls. Currently it can only recommend such tests as it did in the horse meat scandal. We are proposing that in similar circumstances in the future, the Commission will have the power to bind member states to do such tests and not just uh, recommend them. The new proposals are part of a wider package that aims at modernizing and harmonizing rules in Europe's agriculture and food sector. This sector is the second largest in the EU, employing over 48 million people and it is worth over 750 billion euros a year.